Welcome to technical drawing. Today we'll see this semi oblique. We have front view and top view of this object. Length is 150, which will go on left side. Height is 60, and width is 60, which will go on right side. Now we have taken 45 degree. Now if you see, there are two parts. Part one and part two. In front view, you can see two part. And if you see this part one, it is nearer to observer, and part two is behind, right? So we'll start with part one. So we'll draw part one. For that, I will take 90, 70 plus 20. Then I will draw a vertical line. This height is 30. So I will take 30 and I will join the slope. So we got part 1. Now whatever is there in the front, the same thing is behind. With that concept, I will take this behind. We'll join this. This will be vertical. Now if you see in top view it is 15, 15. So I will mark 15. Here also I will mark 15 and from here 15 and then I will join. This is dark and from your vertical line. Here also this line will be done and we'll draw a vertical line. It is dotted in front view but that will be dark over here. So this way we are done with part 1. Now for part 2, if you see part 2 is how much behind? 15 behind. So you go 15 behind. So from here you take 15. And from here also you take 15 and you draw a line. So what we are doing, if you see in top view, we are drawing top view of part 2. Now we need to draw a circle. So for circle how much we have to take? We have to take 30 from here. So I will take 30 from here and I will draw an axis line. Always remember in oblique, always try and draw in oblique as well as ISO, draw axis line. You take 60 down. You take 30. And now you draw axis line then after that from the center point we'll take this radius and we'll draw a circle
Now from the same center, you draw radius 15. So diameter 30. So we are done with part 2. So we have done two circles. One is radius 30 and one is radius 15. And we'll draw this dark. After that, whatever is there in the front, the same thing is behind. Now see this circle is behind also. So how much you have to go behind? We have to go behind by 30. So let's mark this point as M. And take this point M which is center point. Go behind by 30. Take this radius. From here you can mark radius 30. So whatever is there in the front, the same thing is behind. And then you draw a tangent. You draw a line like this. So we are done with this sum. I hope you people have understood this. This is an oblique sum which came in ICSC Technical Drawing Application Exam 2019. Thank you.